A local Tucson group is collecting Hawaiian shirts to send to deploy troops, and they have a lofty goal. News for Tucson's Connor McGill is live tonight in our newsroom to tell us more. Connor. Well, Eric, if you've ever known someone who served in the military, you know how much they love their care packages. But how about a Hawaiian shirt? I spoke with several Tucson community members who hope to bring joy to our men and women serving overseas. It may just look like a simple Hawaiian shirt, but to Barbara Brownlee and her two friends, this shirt has brought a new sense of joy into their lives. The star and the, po and the pocket note, probably written by a child, that goes in there and then the shirt is ranger rolled. It was back in 2018 when Brownlee came across a posting from a army mom on the East Coast asking people to send in Hawaiian shirts. The reason, to ship the shirts to her son and his friends who were deployed in Fort Campbell, Kentucky. I believe I saw it on Facebook. I don't know how those things on Facebook pop up that you're supposed to do. So I inquired and the rest is history. The call out went viral. Instead of shipping shirts just to those at Fort Campbell, they open it up to soldiers deployed far and wide. Five years later, Brownlee continues her passion here in the Old Pueblo, but now she's on a new mission. We are now in the process of doing Operation 300, where we will collect 300 Hawaiian shirts for the troops. Brownlee says with every shirt set and received, a sense of happiness something she says is indescribable. When you get that kind of fe feedback, that just fuels our fire because it, the impact is way bigger than we'll ever understand. For more information on how you can help in their efforts, you can go to our website at kvoa.com. Live in the newsroom, Connor McGill, News for Tucson.